2007 Honda Civic uh, technician owns this car and she purchased it I guess from somebody recently and AC doesn't cool so well when it's hot and it cools well when it's cold and uh, I noticed the UV dye that was in the cap when I opened it if you can see that nice little bright spot right there and then I asked her she said the owner previous put in refrigerant and dye and now it's not working so I check and it is 100%. If we'll focus their apple, very good. 4.3% uh, air mixed in with the refrigerant. And uh, so that's no bueno. It's not gonna sink to Titanic, so no big deal. But that is unacceptable. So here, let me take a snapshot of that. I need that for my records. That always goes in with the customer's um, invoice. I document everything, weights in, weights out of refrigerant. And let's take the superheat and subcooling. We're gonna hook up to this now. And uh, don't forget your UV Beast version three. This is one of the older last really good models. And for looking for using UV dye. And, oops, and let's drop an expensive piece of equipment. This is the DTEC Stratus for looking for leaks. I was using that and you have your big blue micro leak detector this stuff is thick and it stays wet for a long time and even if you get one tiny bubble out every four or five minutes it will show it okay so i'm going to hook up here we're going to come back on the next video and we're going to look at the sub cooling not the superheat this is the expansion valve system superheat can tell you things on expansion valve but we're going to look at the sub cooling first so let's come back we'll power up our um SM480V and all this stuff is available at True Tech Tools. Don't forget my offer code, LEC Air, L A C H, all one word, all capital letters, gets you 8% off on any of the purchases. See you guys next video. Let's look at this super sub cooling.